She came to my seat and loudly asked to speak to me in private and escorted me off the plane as though I was a criminal. I felt it was a spectacle aimed at punishing me for not being a woman in the way she thought I should be a woman. In January, Lisa Archbold was flying out of Salt Lake City to San Francisco when she was told to get off after everyone was boarded and quiet. She says they told her she needed to cover up because what she had on was too revealing. Lisa, who identifies as queer, says she was dressed like a little boy in baggy pants and shirt. She posted this picture on Twitter of what she was wearing. Lisa says Delta told her it's their policy that women need to cover up. She was told if she put on a jacket, she could fly, so she complied. Now, Lisa and her attorney are calling on the airline to change that policy. Delta's contract of carriage reads that Delta may remove a passenger when reasonably necessary, it's a quote, for the, quote, comfort or safety, end quote, of passengers. For example, when, quote, the passenger's conduct, attire, hygiene, or odor creates an unreasonable risk of offense or annoyance to other passengers. Please explain how wearing a T-shirt without a bra causes, quote, an unreasonable risk of offense or annoyance. Lisa has filed an official complaint with the airline and is waiting for a response. Her attorney has not filed a lawsuit yet and wants the policy changed.